Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to find the central angle rounding to the nearest whole number using percentages of the circle. Now, it's one of those pretty straightforward um, ideas because, as you know, a circle is 360 degrees. So to find out the measure of the central angle here and round it to the nearest whole number, what you want to think about is take the percentage of the circle that you're looking for and then simply multiply by 360. So for example, if you know that you want to look for, let's just say, how many degrees 25% of the circle is, what you can do is do 25% and then times 360. You can do 0 0.25 times 360 if you want to convert it that way, or you can even do 1 4th of 360 and you'll get 90 degrees here. Or if you want to think about half or 50% of the circle, you want to multiply by, by 360 to find out what the measure of the central angle there. 50% uh, is like saying 1 half times 360 and that'll give you 180 degrees. Now if it's going to be more technical percentages like 15, 16%, then do the same thing. Turn into a decimal, multiply by 360, and then if it's going to be a decimal answer, then you round to the nearest whole number. But either way, take the percentage, convert it to decimals or fractions if you want to, and then multiply by 360. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's how to find the measure of the central angle rounding to the nearest whole number using percentages of the circle.